G'day fellow Black Pillars and Ink Worlds, it's uh, Master Yodi here and hope you guys are all doing well. The title of today's video is called uh, The Men Are the Prize Cope and I must thank El General 0618 for this topic suggestion. Thank you very much for that, I do appreciate it. Um, yeah, if you go on a lot of Manosphere channels, um, a lot of them will say, oh, us men, we're, we're the prize, you know, um, not women. Uh, I, sorry, I have to say that that's the biggest stinking pile of bullshit and cope out there. Um, as El General zero six one eight correctly points out, women will always be the prize since they have the ability to bear children. Well, that's right. Uh, sperm is abundant, uh, eggs are rare, and the only men who are who are truly the prize are those high status or very good looking guys. You know, those top five to ten percent of men, um, which is only a very very small minority, I mean, that, that top percentage of guys. Um, you know, obviously women see average and ugly uh, looking men as nothing, as, as nothing that can easily be replaced. Yeah, they, they can be very easily replaced. Um, yeah, the, I don't know why these Manosphere guys go on with this with this crap that men are the prize cope. We're not. It's really, it's women. Um... And also, too, you also have to take into account um, that I think there is a shortage of women. There really is. I mean, you know, you go to nightclubs or singles functions and what have you, and there's always, um, in most cases, or not, maybe not always, but there's always a, you know, there always tend to be sausage fests. I mean, I, as I've said in previous videos, I can remember from even back in the 1980s, which is, what, 40 years ago, Men complaining to me saying, "Oh, Master Yoda went to this nightclub or bar and it sucked. Uh, the too many, too many, too many dudes, not enough women." And I, I hear this all the time. Obviously, there are some exceptions to that. Like, for example, when I went on that cruise with my Chad friend, where there was actually more women than men, doing a rough head count. In my estimation, I think women outnumbered men by a ratio of two to one. But it didn't make it easier to find someone to find a woman because this is how hypergamy kicks in. And and all all the women were chasing that top uh, you know top percentage of guys in terms of looks. I mean, honestly, you could you could have a a singles function. Uh, just say for just say for argument's sake, there's two hundred people there. There's um, I don't know hundred hundred. Say, say let's just say it's evenly divided. Well, no 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 sorry bad bad, bad example sorry slip of the tongue. So, okay, well, you've got, you got a singles function, 200 people. There's 150 women and 50 men. Okay, so, you know, as a man, you think, oh, God, this this, this sounds good. Women outnumber, women outnumber us, I've got a chance here. But of those 50 men, if only five of those men were attractive and the remaining 45 being unattractive or ugly, I would bet my two balls that those 150 Women would chase those five guys and would ignore the other forty-five men. Trust me, it'll happen. Any, any, every day of the week, any day of the week, that will happen. I've seen it happen. Maybe not to that extreme, but I have seen groups of multiple groups of well, multiple groups of women chase that small, you know, that top percentage of guys in terms of looks, and it'll happen. Yeah, yeah, that that would happen. Yeah, if you had a scenario where women outnumbered men it wouldn't make it easy for the men because what would happen is you'd have all those women they'd be chasing that top five to ten percent of good looking guys and would ignore the rest of them it'll happen it, it will happen and i've seen it happen and many other members of the black pill ink or community have told me exactly the same thing um they've gone to a singles function or whatever and Pretty much all the women were chasing that that, that top five to ten percent of guys in terms of looks. Yeah, absolutely. So, yeah, no. Um, uh, this men are the price cope. Yeah, it's pushed out by a lot of manosphere channels. I don't know why. Look, a lot of men have got to start. I got to start um, developing some more self awareness. As I've said in previous videos, if you're not a particularly attractive guy, own it, and just be honest about it. You know, you're kidding, you're kidding yourself, and you're kidding the world if you think you're some sort of, you know, Casanova that everyone wants to sleep with. No, no, no. Be honest. You know, if you're not that attractive, just own it, own it. And 
Yeah, and as I said before, the this a uh, lot, lot of the Manosphere channels are particularly the PUA ones. They put out this men of the price cope. Uh, we're not the price, <laughs> definitely not. Anyway, look, that's all I have to say on the topic. Uh, if you'd like to leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll speak to you soon. And you guys have a great day, and bye for now.